Rocky Marciano had 49 fights with 43 knockouts and no losses. He joined boxing late, aged 23. He would rely on his fitness to make up for his lack of technique. His boxing style is an aggressive, high volume, pressure fighting style that uses the old school boxing stance, a deep crouch and power punches. His style was simple and effective like a hammer. Nothing fancy, nothing extra, just straight to the point. He was a fighter who boxed rather than a boxer. Rocky had great power in his punches, but the key to Rocky's success was maintaining that power over the course of the fight. Marciano had some of the best stamina seen in boxing. He was able to just keep throwing. He had one punch knockout power even in the 13th round against Jersey Joe Walcott. Real power. It looks like Rocky punches Joe's soul out of his body. Marciano's training had nothing fancy in his fight camps. He focused on standard boxing exercises. His road work would be 5 to 10 miles a day. Skipping. Speed bag. He had a 300 pound heavy bag. Then lots of sparring and drill work in shadow boxing. He was willing to put in the work in his training so he didn't run out of energy in the ring. Marciano did not utilise the jab often, although when he did, he had a stiff jab which would damage his opponents. and he would add the left hook, mixing up his offence and getting round the guard. Marciano's power punches would bruise your arms and make them numb. He wanted to fight you on the ropes. If you stood still, he could do a non-stop barrage of power shots. He was always walking forward, but didn't like chasing people around the ring, so he would land heavy shots to get them on the ropes. To do this, he had to take away your jab. He would often dip to the right, getting to the outside of the jab, minimising its impact, reducing the damage. He would then throw huge counters, which would wear his opponents down. He wanted to fight. He wanted to land powerful punches, not jabs. Marciano would also use the right hand to the body to slow down his opponents. By hitting the body with powerful punches, you would always be cautious of getting hit by that again. And this played right into his hand. When you would throw it to the head, which was a devastating shot if it landed, it would hurt you. By landing consistently to the body, it not only wears them down, but makes them easier to hit. Marciano was able to double up his left hooks, as he demonstrated against Harry Matthews.
and he used them as counter shots, particularly to the jab, mixing to the body and head. Marciano's defence was simple and effective. He would dip to the right side in an already crouched position. He'd use his right hand to cover his face and to parry jabs. The old school boxing stance is a counter punching stance. Marciano used this but exaggerated the crouch more so as he would dip as a primary form of defence. Rocky would throw his punches with such commitment that if they missed, he would go flying around the ring. So not only does that burn up energy, you're also exposed to counter punches until you gain your position again. By keeping his style so simple, a deep crouch to minimise damage and constant heavy punches to overwhelm his opponents, this meant his late entry into the game was okay, as he had the fitness to pull it off. There is always going to be talk of his record as undefeated champion and people will always scrutinise his opponent's age. He did his job, he beat everyone that was put in front of him. Was he the best ever? No, I don't think so. But Rocky was tough as nails and an excellent fighter. Let me know in the comments if you like this video. I'm currently making a how to box up Marciano video which will be out soon for those of you that like his style and think it's something you want to do, as not many people will teach it. I've also got the old school fundamentals that will give you all the info you need to get yourself started. Just remember, keep your left hand high, chin down and keep punching.